Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'll be testing updated configurations that eliminate all glitches and vertex explosions in even 0.3. I've been a bit busy lately, but I'm still testing the game, and based on my results, these are the most optimized settings so far. They provide around 12 to 18 more FPS compared to Ryujinx, even though they're not perfect until the game gets fixed in a future update. For the system tab, leave everything on default, nothing needs to be changed, and it won't give you any extra performance. For the CPU tab, remember to set accuracy to unsafe for better performance. This option should be enabled especially on processors like first generation Intel or any CPUs older than like 2013. Without it, your game will suffer a massive FPS drop because these processors lack the instruction sets that speed up emulation. In the graphics tab, there's not much to tweak, it's up to the user to choose the best settings based on what their GPU can handle. Options like SMAA and FSR are welcome, but keep in mind that Eden uses more VRAM than Ryujinx and tends to be more demanding on AMD graphics cards. In the Graph Advanced tab disable all performance hacks. In my tests, enabling them is what causes all the rendering bugs, crashes, and other issues. So the only options that should be enabled in this tab are Enable reactive flushing Fast GPU time, hack Use Vulkan pipeline cache Barrier feedback loops, for more precise emulation at a minimal cost to performance. For the GPU level section, I strongly recommend keeping it on normal. However, if you have a more powerful GPU, like an RTX 2000 series or AMD 5000 series and above, you can set it to high for better accuracy and fewer bugs or glitches. This may come at a performance cost, although in my tests, I didn't experience any drops. That's the intended purpose of this configuration. For now, I'll leave you with the test. The machine isn't mine, it belongs to the sweetest person in the universe who helped me test these settings and bring this video to life. I tried to make the video as dynamic as possible with the background test, so I hope you enjoyed this format.